the Dunstall handicap now from Wolverhampton. This has been split. It's another 0 to 70, one mile free. This is race one of the split. Lipu Crest for Vinny Gerard. Pure Whim, your 5 to 2 favourite for T Rogers. Radio Therapy for Martin Leadham at threes. Renegade for Mark Jones, nines. Benchmark for Hems. Motorface for Mark Jones, sevens. Longfort for John Seaford. Nimue for Derek Hinton. And Shan Idea for James Shea. Gale Force for Gray. And Ninfea for R. Costello. 11 go to post. So I'd imagine there'd be a fair few in Division 2 of this handicap, but in Division 1, we've got the 11 and they're off. Long fought for John Seaford makes that mandatory charge for the front. Renegade has got a nice position on the rail. So it's Long fought and Renegade is settling down. Benchmark for Hems in between. Here comes Nimue for Derek Hinton making a sweeping move around the outside to try and get to the front. And Nimue just thus does just that. Nimue in the pink and black with Derek Hinton out in front as they are about to go past the winning pole for the first time and Nimue is travelling rather quickly, Longfort's taken a pull and is about three lengths off. Benchmark, Renegade on the rail, we've also got Anshan Idea, Motorface out wide. Ninfaya sat in the pack with Lipu Crest on the outside, Radiotherapy, Pure Whim and Gale Force at the back for Grey. Seven furlongs left to go, Nimue is still Gonna try and burn a trail out in front here. There's still three lengths clear of the pack and still going quite quickly. The jockey's got a hold of him now and the pack starts to come closer. But could the jockey on the Mue be running this to perfection with the clock in the head and is still travelling well? But I think it's too quick and the jockey realises this and it now takes another pull which allows Renegade to pull right alongside with Long Fort. Benchmark's been given a pull as well, but Motorface is the, the jockey on Motorface has decided this is the time to strike. And the Mue's in trouble now with the two Mark Jones horses looming large on the outside. And Motorface and Renegade are coming for first run at the four pole and on the bend. Benchmark's travelling well in about fourth, but it's Renegade out in front for Mark Jones from Motorface for the same trainer. Nimue on the pink on the rails, probably spent. Here's Gale Force has cantered up from the back. So is Radiotherapy. And now they come wide looking for a shot at the two Mark Jones horses but it's Motorface who kicks off the bend and kicks off the bend well it's Motorface from Renegade Benchmark for Hems trying to get back into this Radio Therapy is also there with Gale Force but their charge seems to be dropping away now as Motorface kicks into the final furlong it could be a 1-2 for Mark Jones nothing's really picking up out of the pack Benchmark is staying on now though but it's Renegade on the rail Motorface has given away Renegade Benchmark flashing at Renegade but Renegade holds on Renegade holds on for Mark Jones, who wins round one of the Dunstall Park handicap from Benchmark, who ran well in defeat, sort of got pulled back about the four pole and didn't should have maybe have kept going with the Mark Jones horses, but a good win for Renegade for Mark Jones, eight to one. Benchmark for Hems was second. Motorface third for Mark Jones as well. Pure win was fourth for T. Rogers and Radiotherapy, who went off favourite, was fifth for Martin Leader.